Hello all, Havoc here. Alright, so in our last episode we were, well, we were doing exactly this. I was running cable. So we're going to try to get absolutely as far as possible, if not calling in the ven the trader vendor, um, the guy, the man, the legend. And uh, try to get a, uh, come on, one more, a welding torch. That's our that's our goal. So I think what we're gonna do is split here. Um, I think we're gonna use the angled steel here on the underside of this. So if that's the case, we're going to do this. So we can get our cable ran. All right, so we need to get cable ran from here. Wait, oh, I did that wrong. Right, this is really annoying. That makes me really frustrated about using the jetpack. Oh my goodness, this is so unstable. Alright, let's get to there. And then we'll come up to here. Can we reach from here? No. Come on. All right, so let's get this wrapped up here. Come on up. All right, so here's the part where I want to turn, I think. Because I want to get it off this beam. And we want to get it to here anyway, so. Come on. Wait, no. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, the mistakes that were made. Okay. Okay, that's that. Well, I think what I can do is I can just run one cable here and then branch off and come this direction to the satellite dish and stuff. So that'll be fine. This is going to run two. Oh, just realized what I had done there. I was going to branch off, come this way to the, the landing pad, and then branch off again over here to come over here to the dish. But uh, what I'm going to do is like so... Eventually, maybe. Let's get you going this way. Okay, and then... Come on. So this guy's going to keep going this way for the sake of, like, the elevator and whatnot. Come on. Uh, no, we want to take this guy out. Right? So it goes down the wall? Nope, the next one is the wall. Right? Yeah. Okay, so that'll take care of that. 
This guy's here. Uh, it's data and your power, right? Yeah. Come on. I want to get this going here. A little more. There we go. And now the dish is power. Maybe, maybe, maybe. There we go. Cool. And we'll worry about that one later. We're going to go ahead and do this. I don't know where the vending machine is going to... I should probably figure that out, huh? Alright, let's try that. Let's get that part set up. Vending machine. I'm thinking I want to try to get them to. I have to get behind it. Uh, that's annoying. So I guess I'm going to build this platform all the way across then. And power and data is behind it. That makes it even worse. Alright, so you're going to be right there. Love the floaty shenanigans. That's, that's always so confirming and now you don't want to let me put that there because oh no that's because the walls there let's try that again okay oh let's try that a third time's a charm I think the only thing that works on the slopes is cladding. So I'll have to figure out how to get red cladding. So that'll be new. Because I think the default color is like orange, which, yeah, that's not going to look good at all. And then we want the side piece. Super jump, because why not? Okay. Oh, come on. Okay, so in any case, so the computer's gonna go over here. No havoc. Yes. There we go. Uh, did we bring a computer? Brought two vending machines. Okay, we did bring a computer. Data and power. All right. Can we put this in now? Yeah, okay. It gets us out of inventory, so I'm fine with that. So in theory, we could put another computer over here to run this one. And then... And nope, that's not going to work. We'll need two vending machines. Which, we have two vending machines, so that's okay. Hand drill. How close will you let me get this to that? Pretty close. So we're gonna need another satellite dish for sure. It's fine. We'll work on that going forward. Uh, I'm gonna bring a chute out and probably move one of these 
in a better spot because they're kind of wonky right now. But we're going to put a chute here from over there. And uh, it'll drop off into a bin. So, yeah, that way we know when we want to sell stuff, we'll be able to just dump it off into a bin or just have it go directly in. That's another thing we can do. And input is... That's output. Input's on the... Oh, my goodness. Any machine import. Okay. Okay, power. Power. Power's on the back side of there. Front side of here. Screwdriver. Sweet. I thought they were more complex. And cable cutters. Let's not do or do this without making a mess. AKA falling off. Come on. Okay. That's not exactly how I had that planned. But that's how it's going to work. The advantage to this is we're not going to have to walk into that. Because you can walk through the cables, but you cannot walk through these. These are physical. The cables are not. So I kind of like this better. Come on. It does make it... Data cables are going to be a little bit wonky, but that's fine. Figure it out. And are we out? Ah, oh, come on. Do, 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 do. Really don't want to use gray data cables, though. They're harder to see. I liked the blue data cables we used last uh, last season. It's so much easier to find stuff. Eh. Okay. Oh wait, was that another computer? It is. All right, cool. Can take that up there too. Uh, do we have another communications desk around here? Yeah, buddy. So we just need another satellite dish, and we're, uh, we have two complete setups. Uh, complete with air quotes, because we still have to put... Um, there's still some things we need to get set up, like the piping and whatnot. But Alright, so let's get power to all of this. Come on. There we go. So this is all powered now. I don't think 26 cables is going to be enough. Oh, it was right there. All right, so you uh, need to come out of here. Come on. And come out of here. I 
again, the glorious advantage to it not existing anywhere else but in here is it doesn't have to look pretty. It just has to function. I'm really not sure 18 is going to be enough. Actually, I should take it down here. Like so. There we go. Come on. Okay. And I go the okay, I was thought I went the wrong direction on that one, so I had to double check. Okay. Now I just need to get a data cable out of the vending machine. And we should be good to go. I know, I know. Isn't that a shame? All right, so you. Like so. I don't know if I can be able to do anything fancy from here. Probably not, so we're just going to have to do it this way. There we go. Boom. Hmm. It's fine. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think that was gonna be enough. Ah. Let's go see if we can find some real quick. We're so close. I want to get this running. So close. Uh, come on. I don't want to have to just go craft some because cable is everywhere around here. Obviously not enough of it. Um, we've torn all of this apart. I'm not going to go running across to another station right now to go get more. So let's uh, go upstairs to try to craft some, I guess. I don't know if we're going to have enough gold and or copper. There's some nickel and some gold. Uh, or is it just copper? Oh, the gold's made for the, the, the top stuff, huh? Yeah, it's just copper. Okay. Never mind. Make what you're making, dude. Hey, 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 hey. Oh. No. Stop. Thank you. And now we have to go get some copper. Put this guy here so we make sure we pick up gray ones. Perfect. All right. That's why we're out of copper, right? Yep. Is this evenly placed? Yeah. I don't know, I just seemed like it wasn't. I probably should have had this part of it on this, so we're walking straight up onto this section of the path, but that's being a little nitpicky, I think. I think overall it works. It works. It'll be fine. 
It's fine. It's fine. It'll be fine. Did I get this right? No. I did not. I did. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> I stand corrected. All right, so I need to go down. Can I make this? Yeah, buddy. So I need to go down here and turn this guy on. We're going to max this one out. There's going to be a lot going on over here, so I think I'm maxing it out. I'll be fine. Wait, really? No errors? <laughs> um. Um, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how to react to that. I, I don't want to put my cables in there, though. Luckily, I get those back, so. Uh, please, fend. Thank you. Let's, uh, let's do this so I don't do any more of that kind of shenanigans. I oh, know I don't want satellites. I want traders. Oh. Uh, I can't see. Oh, you guys are in the way, so, um, so 82. So the other way, that's got to go all the way around. Ninety-five. We contact him. Yes. Powered landing pad is required. Oh. Let's try that again. Where's he coming from? Okay. So I guess the direction we place the landing pads is the direction they're going to come from. So that'd be kind of cool if we did these in a clover pattern so they're always facing like outward. Hey buddy, how's it going? What do you got for me? And spray paint. Really? How do we use our credit card? Oh, we have $8,000 balance. Okay. So I do want to buy some blue spray paint. So. Um, I think I'm going to buy a red spray paint too. Just for the sake of having it. And... We'll find some other cool spray paints I'm, I've seen before that you get like khaki and the gray. So uh, thanks, buddy, for visiting and uh, have a nice day. So let's, uh, yeah, dispatch you and depart. Thanks for visiting. So uh, the first one wasn't wasn't bad. Uh, we got spray paint. So we can do blue network cable now. After I just got done running a bunch of it. But uh, going forward, we'll be able to actually do this. Color Corp. They're named. Yay. Let's try. Both are worse. But they're getting better. Okay, so let's go. A couple more. Too far. Bring it. Tech tree. Oh, he's coming in hot. 
<laughs> that would add some randomness to it, wouldn't it? If they came in and like crash landed. All right. So what do you got? Vending machines, transformers, auto lathe. Another auto lathe. That would be kind of nice. A tablet, advanced composter. Oh, it's new. That's part of the new uh, dietary stuff. Uh, kit gas generator, kit wind turbine. Uh, automated ice mining module and a fuse. A ship display, huh? Security printer. Wait, a security printer? I don't remember that one. Because we have all the printer modules, I don't remember a security printer. What is, hold on, hold the phone. So yeah, we have the electronics printer, the auto lathe, the, what is the security printer? Uh, concerned about the needs, uh, use the, to create a cartridge with access to control to, in order to restrict access to different parts of your base, key cards. Okay, that's the key cards we keep seeing. Also make a variety of weapons and ammunitions to defend your base against hostile, aggressive, or just slightly rude entities you can encounter as you explore the solar system. Okay. Uh, it can be made in the electronics printer, so I just don't remember seeing that, I guess. Uh, vending machine refrigerated. Don't really care about that because we're not dealing with food. So, cool. Thanks for visiting, dude. Appreciate you. Okay, so I'm bring that back to... Okay, or one. There we go. So that goes back to 77. And one more click. There it is. Let's call somebody else. Except. It'd be kind of nice if they came from the direction of the satellite dish. So you'd come on the horizon and then come in and land. Uranium. Uh, ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think we might want to, oh, this guy only has one of this ingot, one, how many, how many different ingots does he have? Solder, he has one, Stellite, he has two, Haste Alloys, two, and Invar. You just hang on a second here, dude. I, 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 we need to have a talk here. Well, I'll be right back. I want to see... If he has the ingots I need to make the gun, uh, welder, arc welder. So we need invar, solder, electrum, and steel. Oh, wow. Five grams of invar, 10 of solder. Uh, I don't think he had. He has some of the stuff, but he doesn't have the quantities. So like, uh, he doesn't have Invar. Yeah. Oh wait, yeah, he does right there. So I'm gonna buy that. Solder was the another one, right? Um, I'm gonna buy this Stellite too. I should buy all of his rare alloys. But he has no steel, which eh, it's not that big of a deal, but um solder right there. Which that's not hard to make, but still. We don't have to make it if I don't have to make it. And confirm purchase. So now we have some pretty nice alloys in here. Might need to go get our other credit card. No, we're only down to $7,000. That's, that, that's, that's fine. Okay. 
So, yeah. So the ones that we purchased went from up here and they moved them down to here. So actually, I'm going to buy that too. I'm going to buy all of their their alloys. We don't need copper. Iron, actually. I'm going to buy it. Just, it's something we don't have to go chase down. Um, he has some copper, too. I'm going to buy those, too. And you know what I'm not doing? It's checking prices on things to sell back. Uh, that's something else we need to do. All right, so you know what we're going to do, though? Ah, not that. That would have been bad. <laughs> um, we're going to wrap it up here. In our next episode, that's what we're going to work on. We're going to start getting the chutes and stuff loaded up and get things moving from one place to another. So, whoops, that was exactly what I was going to look for. Dink. And with that, we'll be able to put this into our auto lathe. And shoots and ladders. And we'll start that in the next episode. Thanks for being here. Appreciate you guys' the support. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button as you're leaving a comment down below. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.